Today, we're announcing a few new features that are going to make it quicker and easier than ever to get your files into assemble and organize within your project. So to start, I've created this empty project here with a few tasks. And if I open up these tasks, first thing you're going to see is that I can take some files from my desktop and just drag them directly onto the task to start the upload. Now, if I start this task, the next thing you're going to see is this feature called automatic uploads, which is on by default. And this means that as soon as that upload is completed, it's going to automatically add it to the project without me needing to manually press save. So if I get up, leave my computer for a long upload, I don't have to come back and manually confirm the upload. It will just upload as soon as it's done. My team will be notified and they can start collaborating on those files. Second of all, if I go ahead and drag some more files, you can see that this feature is a personal setting. So maybe I want to turn that off. Maybe I'm the type of person that likes to reorder these files in the upload, maybe change the names and edit those before confirming. And so that's completely up to you and a personal setting that you can set. Next, let's say that we want to add some other file types into these tasks. So let's go into this location scouting task. And up here, you can click attach files and now upload new files directly here. And let's say that we got a link to another uh, Google Drive. So we want to add that as a bookmark. Let's say we got some location options from one of our vendors, and we can just simply add that from directly within that task. And that's now been attached to that task and accessible within the project. Finally, let's jump in this casting task. Maybe we want to go attach a file, but this time we want to add an assemble document. And we could either start a blank document or we could just search the templates here. Let's go ahead and grab this casting notice template from the community and add that to this project as well. And so you can now see how quick and easy it is both to upload your own files and to create your own documents and bookmarks and more directly within Assemble's calendar. However, I'm sure you've worked with project management tools before and know that when you're attaching all these files to tasks and comments, they get lost and very disorganized very easily. But the great thing about Assemble is that because our calendar is broken down by these phases, we have the ability to automatically organize your project for you. What that means is if I open up this first task that we were working on, we can see that this is part of the creative phase. And therefore, when I upload files to this task, they're automatically organized in the creative phase. Same goes for this document in the casting phase and for this bookmark in the location phase. So let's back out of here and go back to our folder view. And when we open the creative phase, we can see all of our files in there for the creative phase, casting files in casting and location files in location. So everything is perfectly organized in this beautiful presentation and you can work quickly and efficiently within the calendar and never have to worry about doing the manual organization yourself. Finally, we've also added drag and drop into the folders as well. So you can just drag assets directly into the folders to upload them directly into your project as well. We hope that these features are going to help you and your team collaborate faster and more efficiently moving forward.